now if you have dark armpits elbows your knees are dark you're going to use this soap this soap is going to help you to lighten up those dark areas the stubborn dark areas yes i'm going to show you step by step hello guys let me hope you're doing fine yes today's main ingredient is baking soda yes we are going to use baking soda to make soap baking soda is very good in lightening up those dark areas then we shall be adding one tomato just get tomato tomato is going to help to brighten and lemon we are only going to get the outer skin yes Lemon is very good in brightening, tomato is good in brightening, even baking soda. So I'm going to use these three ingredients. Then first of all, we are going to get the soap base. Cut any piece of your choice. Cut it into small pieces. Then after you will melt it. baking soda. nyanya. Mkwazi sene nimu. E, na ye kati okusoka. Kansoke ne soap base. Sala sala sabuni wo. Omu, omu melting. Omu sano se. E, Oge na musala bu pisi pisi butini we buti. Gwe sala koka pisi kwa ya galo koze sako na. E, Ovi nene wako. Gwa singo kumanya. Then omalo obu sale sale bu pisi we buti. Ovi sano se. E, ofuna maza manji no gateka monta mwe neneko then no funa no sabuni no mteka mkatono no biteka kuchoto sabuni na sana uka e, after chopping the soap you're going to put it on double boiling to melt so as the soap is melting we are going to be preparing the ingredients yes you're going to need the juice of the tomato so grate it and get the juice of the tomato kati sabuni nga bwasano okeri tugenda kubanga tutegeka juice we nyanya e, osobola just ojikwata no jukuba mblenda obo yagala obo kozese kanino nkabanga kika kwangu ide you grating ebulunji ekole juice bo malogenda bisengeja ofune juice ali pure ali clean ngatali mu bisigo eh e. after grating you're going to strain it to get clean juice yeah so as for the lemon, for the lemon, you're going to grate it. You're going to grate only this outer peel. You need only the zest. Kati ni mu ogena grating ako justika na kakutaka yero koka kewe itaga. Koka koka kwa woji yako. Bioka. Tewe itaga bilala. Kona kona kawate ko lemon inunji nyoku brighteninga egobe embalave e yamba ko akini. So kati wamalo ka oka grating abulonji. Ogenda buko watabu neno wo grating of mixing emu nyanya. E. After grating the lemon, you're going to add it in the tomato juice. E. Remember the ingredients depend on how much soap you want to make. E. If you're making more soap, you can use two tomatoes. If you're making more, you can use two lemons. But for me, I use just a small piece. Then after, we are going to add baking soda. Bomalo kufuna juice wa wenyanya, hogatemu baking soda. Katinzo kusinzi la kusabu ni gwena saze, akajiko kamuna akatundu kabadeka mala. Katwala wa mixinga baking soda ne lemon, biko lechovu. Nebi mala nebi kakana. So you mix it. Then if you have some essential oil, you can add any essential oil you have. Wabango inaka essential oil or gatam. Since we want to exfoliate those dark areas, we don't need to add a lot of ingredients. Baking soda is just enough. Baking soda, tomato, and lemon, just enough. These are going to lighten up those dark areas in less than two weeks if you're serious. Yes. It works. So after mixing, you're going to check on your soap to see if it is melting. Make sure that it melts. No more lumps, no big particles. It should melt completely. Sabuna ina ukumerutinga bulunji yenaina nafuka mazi. 
E, sabuni oma omu amelu tinga bulonji, omla atamelu tinga, wero ino musano sango gase mwa mazi, na yako ka video kajia kujalu vanyuma. So when the soap finish to melt, you're going to add the ingredients, the tomato mixture with the baking soda. I'm very sorry, I, I had paused the camera and I, I did not notice by the time I was adding the tomato, the tomato juice in the soap. Yes, I'm really very sorry about that. When I was doing it, I was like, I was like, I was like, I was like, Kati sabuni we mazo mwole itawa neno na inga tamwe bilongo. Mbade si juki nanti kamele li pozdi. E, na yengo ulumala okubile ita. O mixinga mbilie bilongo vyo. E, ka, ako kapati na kamisi nze kanumye nyo. Kamele na wade nji pozi nze. Nga vinkubye. Nga vinkubye <laughs> na yenga chobo manya sabuni wa malo meutinga. O ino bi mixinga mbulonji. Then no mala no viteka mkatiba ko. Nga wolaba waneno. I think era wano wolaba anti nabita demu. Mm. So after mixing the soap with your ingredients, you're going to put it in your soap mold. Okay. Then you will wait for like one hour, two hours. It will harden. You don't need to put it in a fridge. Yes, as simple as that. It's very easy to make soap, especially when you have a soap base. Soap base is very soft. It melts quickly. So after like two hours, this is my soap. This soap takes long to harden. So you will keep it for at least two weeks before using it so that it harden. You're going to keep it for two weeks. Just put it down on the floor. It will harden. Yes, because of baking soda, it takes long to harden. Yes, so as you can see, it is still soft. That's why you see I'm being careful when I'm removing it. E sabuni ona rawo kuguma ona wa baking soda rawo kuguma eroge na mutereka ko wansi okumala weeks singa bili omtereke ngato na mukozesa agume bulunji bono mukozesa nga agonda wati agenda kugwa o mangu e so soko omtereka agume bulunji kumala weeks bili omalo tandiko mukozesa sabuni ona agenda kuyamba ko ama vivi go gabanga gaguba enkokola zo Ovulago, wabango ya gala kujia mu akini mafesi, na usobolo muko zesa mafesi. Usobolo no muko zesa mbili gona no munaba. Katinze wenti we muko zesa kumavivi, nengko kola. E, muteka obulu unji wenti, soka nengi wako tuzi, ne mala nengteka o sabuni. Ne muleka na akalira o, katine muleka ko kumavivi, ne kunko kola. Oluna kurona, paka rena nabo regulo. Then ni muteka ko kumacha, Nechido nga ngendo kwe baka we ntimbile kako nebika lila kuku mavivi. Binko lede mangu mangu. Mavivi negala ite ni nga mangu ne, ne nko kola mangu mangu. E, kati mungkwa wa ote kamu. Nobile kamu edachikanga tano no mala nobina wako. E, Osawolo muna bomo bili ugona na yenga siwa. Bomo na wako mbili haku siwa. E, nange na muna wako mbili na siwa. Kati justi mkoze saku nko kola kuma vivi ne mungkwawa yes when you when you apply on your knees just leave it on don't wash it off hey, do this in the morning and at night when you're going to wash on the knees and your elbows in the armpits you put the soap in the armpits leave it there for like five minutes then after you wash it off don't leave it there it will itch you you can also use it to wash your whole body but it will itch you. If your seat is itching you, just use it on your knees, your elbows, and your armpits. It's going to help you to lighten up those areas. Yes, thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel, like the video, share it to your friends and family. Thank you. May God bless you.